I would call it revolutionary technology. It's extremely different from the way we've done cooling in the past. Air conditioning is not something that you normally think of when you go into a building, but it's something that impacts our environment a lot. It uses a lot of energy, it uses over 12% of the electricity that we generate here in the United States. It saves between 40 and 80% of that energy that we use to air condition our spaces. The other big advantage is it's incredibly efficient, it's very cost effective. This particular air conditioning technology can provide air that is much more comfortable and healthier than standard air conditioning. And so what DVAP or desiccant enhanced evaporative cooling does is it uses desiccant, it uses evaporative processes, and it uses the membrane to contain the desiccant. Desiccant is like, uh, have you ever gotten, bought something and it had a little packet of silica gel in the packaging? That little powder is a powder that can absorb a lot of moisture out of the air. We thought to ourselves, well, this is a good combination of technologies that can be put together and make an air conditioner that works anywhere in the country. It can work where it's hot and humid, it can wear, work where it's hot and dry, wherever you have a cooling load. Now it's not to say that there haven't been desiccant coolers and there haven't been evaporative coolers, but there's nothing like this which puts together the core elements in as efficient and compact a package as this. We use a specially designed heat exchanger and we bring air through that heat exchanger and it generally gets dried out considerably. And now that air is still warm, but it's dry. And that air is good to then put through an evaporative cooler. And at the end of the evaporative cooler, we have very dry, cold air that we can supply to the building. This is a prime example of the type of technology that NREL works on. It's thrilling. We think it could be very big.